Oh yeah, this is gonna be fun. get right into it oh wait I forgot this is a modern game all right I'll see you guys in about 50 hours <laughs> Okay, so our character. So I always choose the same character pretty much for every Pokemon game I play. Uh, it's a female type, and yeah, her name is always Alexa. She's pretty much like the conqueror of Pokemon games. You know, Skyrena for uh, Souls games and stuff, and Alexa for Pokemon games. Uh, all right, I think I'm gonna go with this one. You know, I think the the regular just looks the best, you know, maybe. I guess silver here. Maybe. Or this one. Yeah, this one. Yeah, this feels this feels right. This feels right. So this is our Alexa. <clears throat> yeah, I think this is good. Okay. Leading the way into the future while valuing our individuality. Leading. Oh, oh man, this game was good. Uh, so I did hear there's a lot of bugs and glitches in this game, but um, I don't know. Hopefully there aren't. Hopefully I don't see many. But yeah. Director Clavel, head of the Uva Academy. Paldea is a sprawling region bursting with lush nature and magnificent landscapes. It is also, of course, home to the mysterious creatures known to us as Pokemon. They reside here in great numbers, in fact. Oh, look at it. So cute. Always gotta have a cute Pokemon to start us off. We, the faculty and staff at Uva Academy, can't wait to welcome you with open arms. The animation! This is, whoa, the most effort I've seen put to a Pokemon game, not gonna lie. So beautiful, so big, so expansive. That pop in mode, not gonna lie. Kinda throwing me off. We're just soaring over everywhere, but this is so cool. This is so cool. Flamingos. Oh, I didn't uh, know flamingos were Pokemon, but alright. Uh, sure. Okay. Oh, look at the birds! They've got little pompadours. What's that? Oh, our house. Whoa, this house is cool. Oh, look at this reading. So studious. Whoa, look at the textures. Wait a minute. Hold on. Look at the textures on those books. Oh, God. <laughs> the low quality resolution. Okay, on oh, Nintendo Switch. It's OLED model, of course, because you know we're bougie. Muncha. Hello there, little buddy. This is a big house, not gonna lie. Never seen a house this big in Pokemon. Where is this open? It's usually just one hallway to the next. Wow. Couldn't wait five seconds. Jesus, man. Look at our face. <laughs> we're like, bro, who are you? Do forgive the intrusion. You are, Miss Alexa, yes. On behalf of the Academy, I must apologize for the late arrival of your enrollment documents, uh, and also for my delay in introducing myself. Okay, fancy. I am the director of Uva Academy. You may call me Mr. Clavel, the director, and you came in person to help my daughter with her first day? Well, I am responsible for the entire Academy, including any failures on its part. So here, at last, are the enrollment documents that should have already been delivered to you. Okay, they came in a bag. <laughs> Goodness, you really needn't have. 
Since you've come all this way, can I at least offer you a cup of tea? Ah, uh, no, ah, uh, no need to trouble yourself. Alexa, I've got a thing or two to discuss with the director here. Why don't you head back up to your room and get finished and get finished getting ready for school? You'll need your bag and your hat as well. Okay. You simply must join me for this cup of, for a cup of this way. Well, how can I refuse such a kind offer? A cup of cup of joke? It's an induction stove. You should get your mom's help if you're going to use it. Nah, I think I'm old enough to cook on my own. What y'all got going on up in here? Why can't I be here? It's my litter. <laughs> it's my. I'm the one going to school. This room is just used for storage. You don't need to go in. Okay. Come on down every which way, every kind of sandwich, any way you want. Our subs are handmade by pros and perfect for picnics. Okay. Turn it off. No TV. It's only a distraction, you know. What's this room? It's your mom's room. Better not go in there without asking. Our mom has a room? Huge improvement. Amazing. Mom's went from living in the kitchen to having her own room. Crazy. Yeah, look at this. We've upgraded. Oh, look at them. They're so adorable. You provide each student entering the academy a Pokemon of their own. I'll ask you to choose which among these three you'd like to have as your partner. Okay, Sprigatito, the grass cat Pokemon. Aw. Fue Coco, the fire croc Pokemon. And Quaxley, the duckling Pokemon. Aw, that's so cute. And they're all very good company. Why, they usually refuse to even leave my side. Okay. What's this? Hmm, so it turns out they're more interested in you, Miss Alexa. The familiar old me. Wow, abandoned. Yes, says dude. I'm telling you right now. The Rotom phone. I got a phone. Wow, my my first phone. Thanks. Um. Oh boy. My first steps into the real world. I'm finally an adult now. Finally, my first task. After leaving this house, I've been trapped in here for 40 years. I can finally leave. Hey, so a uh, fun fact, um, about 20 minutes of footage was actually corrupted and unwatchable basically. My computer was, or OBS was trying to record like 100,000 kilo, 100,000 bits per second. And you can imagine my computer was not very happy with that and did not record that much. So yeah, if you're wondering why there's such a huge cut, that's why, but yeah. The rest of the footage you see shouldn't be corrupted like that. Um, yeah, I hope you enjoy. Um, yeah. It's a must-have for Pokemon trainers. It's a super handy app. Our homeroom teacher, Mr. Mr. Jack, actually made it himself. Cool. Back in my day, we used ordinary paper and handwritten notes to compile our Pokedexes. Oh, uh, when were you alive? During the first Pokemon? During the first Pokedex? It's quite the age we live in now. Oof, filling out a Pokedex by hand, I can't even imagine how much work that would take. Yeah, you should have played Pokemon Legend Arceus, you would have understood. Oh, poor little baby Sprigatito. I still feel so bad. Maybe I had to make a little more time to work on my Pokedex along with all my battling. Oh, right. Speaking of Pokedexes, Alexa, you've probably never caught a wild Pokemon, right? I'll show you the ropes before I take you to the academy. Come with me. No. I'm not coming with you. Find some secrets. Hiding along the shores. Oops. Um. Oh, hey! Oh, it follows me! Oh, look at him. He's getting lost. Come on, water boy. You may have to scramble back out of the water. Um. I guess I almost drowned there. Okay. Okay, let's go back out here. Huh? Mama? Oh, Alexa. I hear that Nimona here will be taking you to school. 
That's right, man. Leave it to me. So you've already managed to make a friend. And I read about all the wonderful teachers you'll have looking after you for school. Plus, so many handy facilities you can use as much as you like. Add in your new friend, Nimona, and it sounds like your school life is shaping up to be fantastic. Now you'll be staying in the school dorm, so I want you to promise me you'll eat proper meals. Here's a bit of spending money to start off with. I also packed a lunch for your first day. A sandwich? Yeah, yeah. They had to explain us what a sandwich was. Um, that sounds weird. And yeah, maybe you'd better take these two. Potions? Let's go. Don't worry, Mom. I promise you, I'll make you proud. If you ever want to come back home, you know your bed is always ready for you. Okay. You two had better. You two had better be off. I suppose. Take care of your, on your way to school. Yes, ma'am. Bye, mom. It's a path that leads to adventure for you and me. Out here, things are different than in town. You're gonna see wild Pokemon out and about. They'll be on the path and in the grass and such. Get too close to one and you'll have to battle, but you've got Quacks for that, right? And if you want to try to catch a Pokemon, you gotta use a good old Pokeball. Oh, thanks. Hey, look, it's a, um, the chomp. Try battling this little chomp, Alexa. Okay. Oh, I snap. Uh, did we just teleport? What was that? Oh, snap. Alright. We got a lot of moves. We got a lot of uses. Jeez. I don't remember it being that many. I must have added more. Hey. Tail whip. Okay. Doesn't matter. That should be good. Yeah, waste of a move. Alright, uh, I guess we just press X. Let's go! Got him. Perfect. Wait, can we sneak up in the grass? No, no we can't. They're chasing us. Help! Help! But they're going far. Oh no, I'm being chased by pigs. Why? What cruel fate. Bro. They are like actually after me, bro. Jesus. Alright, I think we want to sneak. No, they're chasing after me. Here. <sighs> What is that, bro? A bug type, I guess. Perfect. What's up? Oh god, the hop have just faded out of existence. Perfect. What else is around here? Some more uh, items. A super potion, let's go. Dang, one of them already? Jeez. That must really be preparing me. If this game's hard. Oh look! Hey. Little baby flitzling. Perfect. Getting the ball. Perfect. 
I hate Luke. It's a Pokemon from the opening. Who are you? Paul me? More items to collect. There's so many items. Oh, being stopped by something. Hey Alexa, you getting the hang of how to catch Pokemon okay? Yes, I in fact am. I didn't need you to um, ask me that. Let me see, so far you've got... Gagiao! What was that? Whoa, what was that? I've never heard that kind of cry before. Could be some strong Pokemon or something. I say we find whatever made that cry. Let's take a look around, Alexa. Just be careful, there's a kind of unsafe cave not far from here, so steer here. Steer clear. And I know your Rotom phone can help keep you safe, but watch your step by these cliffs anyway. Okay. Oh. Have to go through here, I guess? Hmm. What's this way? Oh. Hey, what's that? Nani? Oh, the Pokemon is being attacked by a bunch of, by a bunch of, um, wild Pokemon. Ugh, yeah. Oh, no. We fell. What's wrong, little buddy? Oh, too weak to move. Maybe we should feed it. Like what? An adventurer's guide? And a sandwich. Oh, look at him. Mmm, delicious. Oh no, he's angry. What is it, angry to some um, Pokemon from earlier? Oh, it's got magical powers. Who <laughs> brought our face? Whoa. Oi, Alexa. What are you doing up there? What? Why are you up there? Are you okay? You're not hurt, right? I'm fine. I'm managing. Thank goodness I was really worried. If you'd gotten hurt because it was, I said we should go looking for whatever made that cry. No, never mind that. Right now we gotta focus on getting you back up here. You just gotta find some way to climb out of there. If you can get close enough, I'll try pulling you up when one of my Pokemon's moves. Okay. Um, what's going on? Oh God! There's so many of them. Oh. Oh, uh, buddy. Okay, there you go. Oh my gosh, it's straight up pulverized a rock. I wonder what that move was. Man, I want to see it up close. How are you looking at this? Look out, something's coming. Hmm. Behind you, it's behind you. Oh, there it is. Now the big papa wants to come. Hound Doom, baby. I don't know if Plax is gonna be enough. Not gonna lie. Oh my god, it's level 40. What? No way. What? He's too fast. What? He didn't even attack, he just one shot. Okay. That's some cheating, not gonna lie. I couldn't even attack. Oh, you're gonna fight for us? Alright. Oh, are we gonna use you to fight? Bro, the roars though.
Oh no, there's so many of them. I'm surrounded. Oh, it saved us. Let's go. Hey, hey. Up here, quick. Let's go. Why? That little. Oh, who's that? What are you doing out here? Huh? Who's this dude? Oh, dang, rude. Aren't you Arvin? You're ruling the humanities track, right? And aren't you the son of that Pokemon research researcher, Professor Turo? <laughs> what? Why are you so angry? Dude, you good? Alright. Pokemon Trainer Arvin. Easy. This is gonna be easy. Wait, do we get healed? Uh, we did get healed, right? I'm just saying. Bad taste in my mouth. I want it gone. This is cool. This music, though. Alright. Uh, I guess we'll use Pound. Actually, wait, no. Um, I think, um, I think Water Gun would be more effective. Yeah. Use again. Easy. Cool. Oh, I defeated him already. He only had one Pokemon. Bro, this guy is weak. What? Seems you know a thing or two about battle. Cool. You only just caught him? What? Why? Look, Alexa, that's Mr. Goza. Wow. So pixelated and beautiful. Man, so beautiful. So beautiful. Look at those trees. Trees, so beautiful. Oh, they're like PS1 graphics. Yes, this, this is a modern day Pokemon game. Beautiful, looks like Final Fantasy Seven. Okay. Um, what, what, uh, what just happened? Uh, game? You okay? So I'm guessing this place is full of water types. <gasps> Wait a minute! Oh, right there! Oh, right there! He's here! He's here, look! 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 I got him from behind. I caught him off guard even though he was looking at me and then turned around. Makes sense. I gotta catch you. The game's pretty much won at this point. You know? Like, pretty much everyone should just give up. I have on my team a whooper. I'm like ultimate. Like, pretty much, I won. Greatest name of all time. I'm dumb adding it to my party. Get off, nobody likes you, Radis. Hey, how's it going? It's me, the guy talking in the video. Anyway, this video is getting kind of long, so I thought I would take a quick second to chat with you guys and give you a break. I know these long-form videos can get pretty difficult to finish, so this is a good breaking point for you guys. So, how you been? Is the wife good? Oh, also I almost forgot, thank you guys for all the recent support on my last few videos. I really appreciate any support I get, as it really helps give me the motivation I need to continue with projects like this. You know, these videos take a long time to make and it gets kind of hard to find a drive to work on them when... Uh oh, 
That sounds like it's about time to wrap this up. Well, I guess I better let you guys go. If you made it this far, thank you for listening, and I hope you're having a good day. Alright, I'll be back in about another half hour or so. So until then, peace. Like one more. Oh, look at it. It's a donut dog. What? What is that? Fido? That's adorable. Perfect. Now we're finally here. Into the actual city. Finally. Hey, look. It's a shop. Bro, these shops look way different. Whoa. It's like a... It's, what is this? These Pokemon centers, what happened? Man. They must have lost all their funding. Or put it all into the technology. Pokey Dollar? And, there's an, and this, to my right, is a technical machine. Technical machine? Machine? Okay. Okay. In the stores, I've got a lot. Here, have some. Yeah, of course you do. You love battling, huh? I have seven. Some of these do. And at the Union Circle, you can connect with other trainers to find yourself some adventuring companions. Okay. Remember, had a rough adventure? Get to the Pokemon Center. Okay. Here's another one. Are you ready? Then let's go. Oh, okay. Oh, wait. Oh, pressing R button is a quick and easy way to tell your lead Pokemon. All right, buddy, let's go. Your Pokemon will set up on its own, will set on its own to battle nearby Pokemon or pick up items to find in this area. It won't be able to go exploring on its own, so if the Pokemon gets weak, try to heal it up with a potion or some other item. You won't need to give any orders, it can battle on its own with auto battles, meaning you can keep searching the area for new discoveries while watching over from nearby. Oh. Okay. Weak. Easy. Man. Our little Warrior Boy is um, quite the beast, isn't he? Just like crushing all these Pokemon. Look at him, he's crying. Or she's crying. You know, my Pokemon have full HP. Yeah, mine didn't. Not gonna lie. Thank you. Did you know? Oh, okay. So let me see. What are you gonna do? Oh, look at them, they're fighting. Oh, dang. That was quick. Bro, that's fast. Hey, hold on. I'll actually come back. I don't think we need to murder all the dogs. I just wanted to test that out. Bro, <laughs> water boy is going in. Come on, buddy. Oh, EXP candy, let's go. Barquexa has been like going in on like everybody. Jesus Christ, man. Calm down, bro. He's like straight up just murdering everybody. Like, look at this. I've got two. I've got two whole Pokemon. Am I cool or what? Wow, good job, buddy. Easy. You know, I miss how um, in Pokemon Legend Arceus, the, they used to actually rush at them, which is pretty cool. Oh, wait, oh. I forgot to turn off set. Nah.
Easy. He looks so defeated. Wow, my two Pokemon. Loser. I wonder how come it doesn't zoom in though. That's kind of weird. Golfing? Bro. Disgusting. Weak. These Pokemon are so weak. Easy. Safe trip then. How come it doesn't zoom in on their faces? That's weird. Like what, can we take pictures? Oh, we can change our outfits. Oh. Wait. So we have different outfits? Oh. Oh, this is cool. Okay. Alright, that's cool. We can change our outfit. What else do we have? A uh, camera? Okay. Notices and animations. Okay, or emotes. Okay, so that must be for all I believe. I'm gonna have to check that out. Oi, Alexa. You're great, you again. I'm already getting annoyed of you. Please leave me alone. Are you kidding me? All you want to do is battle. Bro, fine. You see, like, I'm getting better at this, so I'm coming at you with two Pokemon this time. Oh, wow, two. Interesting. Alright, who's your other Pokemon? Bro, I imagine just like a, um, a level 60 Garchomp. Oh, Akaje? Yes. Okay. What do you like to switch our Pokemon? No. I'm just not gonna switch. You're legit, Alexa. I'm just not gonna switch so that I can make it a little more challenging. So this one's lightning type, I mean electric type, right? So I'm just gonna switch out. Um, whooper. Whoop boy. Come on, one whoop boy. Aw, oh, yeah. Look at him. Battling you is a blast. Think I better pull out my ace in the hole. Okay. Oh, what? Um, wait a minute. Hold on. Well, what is this? Oh. Uh... Okay, so we're cheating now. I see. Terrestrializing is always a solid strategy. Okay. Oh god, yeah. Doesn't matter. I'm cheating too, so it's alright. <laughs> and it's dead. Should've went up against the whoop boy. A critical hit? Wow, nice one. I have a hard time landing those even when I try. It's kind of random, so it doesn't matter. Defeated. Destroyed. The whooper is too powerful. Give up. Behold his glory. All shall kneel in the face of whooper. What? Bug is evolving. Oh no. Or over, oh, yeah. Oh. Spupa. Oh yeah, we're here, baby. Man, city's huge. Awesome. Oh, they got cafes and stuff. Oh man, I can't wait. I'm so excited to try everything, bro. Oh, city looks so good. Looks so good. Love it.
All right, here I am. We finally made it, huh? This is Mesa Goza, the city, biggest city in Paldea. It's been a big trade hub since a long time ago. Lots of folks come here to learn about advances in technology and all kinds of other stuff. A hair salon? Actually, that's not that impressive. That's like in every single city. What do you want to see first, Alexa? Wait, you didn't even explain the tasty food. I'm gonna need to go get some food though. Ha, huh. I didn't have you pegged for a big eater. You can't battle with a growling tummy, right? Um, duh. I want to be sure you'll be able to terrestrialize your Pokemon too, Alexa. Okay, thank you. Okay, oh, we can change our uniform. You've got to see Delibird presents. They sell handy items for Pokemon. Oh, oh, okay. Once you've seen your field, we can meet up again in front of the school. Just be ready. The stairs up to the school are no joke. Huh. Alright, bye. Finally. Gee, she's gone. Yeah, I don't want to admit it to her face, but she is kind of annoying, guys. I think she needs to learn how to calm down sometimes. Seriously. Back again. If you made it this far, you should be around half or so through the video. Pretty long, huh? Yet you're still chugging along. I hope you've enjoyed the video thus far, but it only gets better from here. Trust me. Anyway, I'm sorry for the lack of energy in this section, but I was really tired while recording it, so I didn't have the most energetic personality. But throughout the second portion, you should notice a significant shift in energy and tone. Also, have you guys been enjoying this new editing style? I'm thinking about making longer format videos like this two or three times a week. I'll also still be posting my shorter 15 to 20 minute videos of course, but this way you get a mix of long form content and short form content to enjoy. I hope you appreciate the effort. Well, that sounds like it's time for me to wrap it up here. Well then, as always, I hope you enjoy and I'll talk to you guys in a few. Hey, guess what? I know how to dance. Look at these moves. Yeah, bet you never seen these before. Ooh, watch this slide. Uh, slide. Creep walk, creep walk, creep walk. Slide. Creep walk, creep walk, creep walk. Yeah. I'm gonna go professional. You know, catching Pokemon isn't really my hobby. It's more of dancing. Oh, look at these kids, having fun, enjoying life, huh? Oh, look at them, what you drinking? Oh, what's wrong with this kid's face? Uh, sir, are, are you okay? Uh, I don't think this kid's okay. Hey, hey kid, um, I'm gonna leave. Uh, what's going on here? Oh God, <laughs> the people in the background. <laughs> Help, I think they're, um, I think they're glitching between 2D and 3D. They need help. Maybe if I get closer, it'll save them. Yep. Perfect game. Hello there, sir. That is one fat. Whoa, that that squirrel is absolutely chunky. Jesus Christ, you're even bigger than I remember. Holy crap, man! What have you been feeding it? Jesus, take care of your Pokemon, man. Don't let it get that big. What's in here? Seabreeze Cafe? A space to relax away from the hustle and bustle of daily life. Oh, we can buy food. Okay. I guess we can feed these to our Pokemon, huh? Oh, wait, these are for raids. Oh, okay. <gasps> they got a battles. They got a battle area. Oh, we can have battles. Oh, that's so cool. Come on. Come on, Quaxi. Or, um, Waterboy. Come on. We're gonna have some battles. Let's go. Oh, look at him. He's running around. He's like, where's my battle? Where's my opponent? It's the bench, Claxley. The bench. I'd love to see a battle. I could use a thrill. Yeah, me too. Are you a trainer? 
No, nope, you're just you're just an NPC. Why does everyone have this face? What is going on? Like, is is there some kind of disease? There's some kind of smiling disease? Oh God, that's creepy. That is very creepy. Oh, hey, look, it's another student. Hello there. Oh God. Hey, wait a second. Isn't that the guy from earlier? Are you lost, sir? Is, is it that way? Huh? Is is what? Sir, are, are you okay? You were glitching out earlier. Um, I think the guy is, um, he might be a sorcerer. Watch out for him. He seems suspicious. What's in here? Oh, Deadly Bird Presents. Oh, uh, we can get items and stuff. Um, or tone phone cases. Hold up. Oh, you can get different. Oh, that's so cool. Hold on. Oh, wait, I want, I want, uh, Quaxley or Turquoise. Bro, these look so cool. Oh no. Oh no, I think I'm gonna get addicted. Oh, I'm gonna get addicted. Okay, I'm gonna pay with cash. Yes. What else do they have? Oh, they don't have anything else. Okay. Uh, general goods? Uh. Hmm. Well, I don't even have any, any money. I'm poor. Sorry. What about in here? Um, hmm. Oh, this is where you buy items and stuff. Um. I guess I could buy one of these for, uh, Quaxley. Yeah, I guess I could buy one of these for Quaxley, you know? Uh, what else? Uh. Hmm. Bug type moves, physical. Special. Oh, I don't have enough money. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, that's good. I'm good. I think I've spent all my. I think I've spent enough money. Oops. The only sad thing about this is the fact that you know we can't actually go inside the stores, and we have to instead just stay out, stay outside of them, or like you know enter a menu, which is kind of a good downgrade, but whatever. Whoa. That guy is rocking the dad bod. I have never seen a Pokemon character built like this. Jesus Christ, these guys look so realistic. Hey, wait a minute. It's the lady from earlier. You can't go inside that store? You can't go inside that door? Come on, bro. There gotta be explorable houses. What happened to the millions of explorable, pointless houses with, like, the same NPCs over and over again? Man, the realism has gone down so much. Jesus Christ. What's up in here? Seafood Fresco? Yeah, he's just all sell food. Okay. That guy is buff. Jesus. You okay, dude? Wait, is that a woman? Wait. Um. Sir? Ma'am? Um. I'm going to go now. Bye. Just looking at all the good things on sale. Um, let's see. We have. Um. Uh, cinnamon rolls? Uh, molten lava rocks from like Legend of Zelda: Ocarina of Time, and uh, croissants. Hmm. Um. Yeah. I don't think you should eat any of those. They'll probably destroy your insides. Oh well. Okay, what's gonna be here? More food. Okay. So it seems like food's pretty uh, common, but it doesn't really have a use, I, I guess. All right. Man, this game looks really good though, not gonna lie. It looks good, but it's like, man, you can tell that they were really lacking. This game could have really um, benefited from having, oh wait, it's a baby Pachirisu. Oh, it's so cute. Oh, it's so cute, but yeah. This game could have really benefited from having, you know, some extra time, like an extra year or so, because, man, you can really see there was a lot of heart and soul. But then you have things like this, where this guy is, like, glitching between, um, 2D and 3D. Do you care how big your Pokemon are? Hey, did you know Pokemon of the same species can come in all sorts of sizes? Take my Pachirisu. It's easy to see the difference between them, right? Me, I've got a sharp eye. I can tell the exact size of a Pokemon just by looking at it. Want me to judge how big or small your Pokemon are? Uh, sure, but also, you are gigantic. What is with the women in this town? They're all huge. 
like really huge. What is going on? Sure. Which volume would you like me to check? Uh, I think it tells me how tall they are, right? Egg? Eh, uh, let's see here. This one seems a bit bigger than average. Oh god. Dang. You know, I thought you said you could tell me the exact same, the exact size. You lied. Oh hey look, it's Combi! Look at them, they're flying. Hey there, little guys. This town feels so lived in though. Jeez, man. You can see the care and compassion. And then, on the other side, you see things like 2D walking images and pop in everywhere like every five seconds there's pop in of something or some character or something and it just it really does break the immersion and i feel really bad because i can see that there was so much potential like look at that bro do you see that come on come on man like i walk like right here and that guy is gone look at that man he's phasing through reality as we speak i turn one way and then they're gone like what what is happening that is so, that is so sad. I think this is a back shot. A canvas bag? Um, can I put it on? Okay, there we go. Oh, I like these. Yeah, I like these. Hmm, I like this one. I like the purple, I like the purple, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I like this purple. Yeah, I'm gonna be fancy my first day of school. I'm gonna be flexing all the time on all the kids. What is this, a um, clothing shop? Or what? Picnics. Picnic snacks? The one stop shop for all your picnic needs? Uh. Oh, you can have picnics? Oh, that's cool. Okay. Oh, uh, Swablu. What's in here? Oh, it's not a real store. Okay. Another cafe. Okay. Another cafe. How many cafes are there? Wait, are there two cafes right next to each other? Okay. Seabreeze Cafe is like Starbucks. They're everywhere. You can't get away from them. Was this a grocery store? Or a general store? Chance to supply. I like how all of them have different names and stuff. Okay. So that's just for items. I don't really need any items. Oh, fashion. That low 2D. That breaded thing looks like something from the N64. Hold on. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh, wait. We can buy gloves and hats and sunglasses. Okay. I want gloves. Not gonna lie, I need me some gloves, man. I need to be fancy. Uh, I'll wait. I'll save my money. I won't just buy pointless stuff. What else do they got? Any other hats? Besides the, um, besides the callback to Sword and Shield? Glasses? Um,. Nah, mid. Everything here is mid. Okay. But look at this image, bro. Look at this. What is this, bro? This looks like something from Banjo and Kazooie, bro. Like those are the pick character PNGs from Banjo and Kazooie, like straight up. What is this? Oh my god, it looks so bad. Oh, I like these. Yeah, I like this style. Oh wait, I'm poor. No, I'm too poor. I spent all my money on a backpack. <laughs> no. Well. Oh well. I guess I'll rock the basic look. Okay, glasses. Hats. Hmm. Alright. I think maybe, um... Hmm, maybe... Maybe the ghost type. Maybe the ghost type or the poison. I think the poison.
Don't you get it? If you join Team Star, you can shine as bright as anybody. Uh, Todoroki? Um, walk away. Yeah, sure, I hope, bro. Hey, stop that! <laughs> Great. Uh, no. Ugh, another inner, ignorant little one, little nobody. <laughs> wow. Yeah, you're nobodies. You're called Grants. We can't let this slide. Okay. Alright. Alright, buddy. You got no drip. Alright, so I guess this is a Grant team. Or the, um... You know, the team for this game. Team Star. Alright. So, what would this be? Shrewdal. What would that be? Like, poison? Normal? I have no clue. I'm gonna wing attack. Weak. Um, another wing attack. Pathetic. Well, that was easy. Oh no, she's gonna report us. I can't believe you, Alexa. You ain't have to go find Randos to battle. You'll have all the battles you'll ever need with me. Um. Yeah. I get it now. You two have got Team Star written all over you for sure. I don't know, maybe it could be the hats. Good for you. Huh? The Terror Orb. Okay. So this is the new Mega Evolution. You can terrestrialize your Pokemon during battle. Let's see, after it, after it terrestrializes, I'm pretty sure you're pretty sure your Coaxi will be a water type. It it are what it already is a water type. Alright. Team Starter. Young Goose. Oh, this is normal type wasn't definitely. Here in the Paldea region Pokemon can crystallize. Okay. You won't be able to terrestrialize the Pokemon again until you heal up at the Pokemon Center. Okay. Alright, I get it. Alright, how do I... How do I terrestrialize? Oh. Alright. And now we use Aqua Jet. Oh yeah, baby. Yeah. Now we're radiating power. True duck. Behold. And now Aqua Jet. Whoa. That animation though. Weak. I didn't even need to do it to him, but I still am. Because I'm like that. Crush that kid. Oh, learn bite? Okay. Um. Huh, I don't know. Tail Whip is not really good, right? Defense or attack? Um. I'd say. I'd say. Um. Hmm. Wait, ask for advice. Wants to forget tackle? Yeah, I guess that'll work. Okay. Well, that's cool. That's cool. They, um, you can just ask the Pokemon. They'll um, suggest a move so that you don't have to worry about which move you might forget. Okay. I didn't know that. Or I didn't notice that. Oh, okay. That makes sense. Well, I'll be on my merry way then. Yeah, hasta la vista. Me too, hasta la vista. Um, I don't think that's real Spanish. I'm just saying. Um, excuse me. Aw. Okay. 
She's not even wearing a school uniform. Is that legal? Already becoming a big hero around campus. Maybe she's a new transfer like you. Love that fluff. Yeah, that Eevee bag was cool. Alright. To make it sound so bad. Why is she complaining so much about the staircase? Like, what's wrong? Let's go. Alright. I guess we'll just go straight up. It's tough being a kid. Time to study hard. This guy does not seem happy. Alright. So tough. This is a famous torturously long staircase of the academy. Not an easy climb, is it? That was pretty easy, not gonna lie. I could do that like 12 times. Here we are, Alexa. Welcome to Uva Academy. This here is the entrance hall. You can sign up for all kinds of classes at the desk behind me, and those halls off to the sides lead to all different parts of the school. It's totally big enough to let loose and battle in here, but for some reason, they banned Pokemon battling in the main entrance. Oh. Uh, Miss Alexa, Miss Nimona, how did you find your first school com commute? We had a blast. I imagine Miss Nimona's high spirits helped with that. She's a true asset to our fine academy. Not that I was expecting any less from our champion ranked student council president. Reliable as ever, Miss Nimona. Well, I know how to look after my friends, right, Alexa? Oh, but speaking of which, we saw some of those Team Star kids in town, Director. You did? Where? Wait, did you see that? Hold on, was there something in the background up on top? Was that a Pokemon? It was down the stairs from the front gate. They were hassling this kid with an Eevee backpack. That is quite the news. Are they still to be found out there? Actually, Alexa flexed on them. <laughs> flexed. Wow. On him and ran him off. Okay. You don't say. Of course, it's a fine thing to try and help a fellow student, Miss Alexa, but you might wish to show a bit of restraint as you find your feet here at our academy. Okay. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, no. These poor children. What is this? What am I looking at? Oh, God. What am I looking at? Boys, what's up? I don't follow the rules. Could I trouble you for a few words introducing yourself? Sure, I'm Alexa. Right, I'm Alexa. Not the same option, okay. She seems super friendly and fun. Looks like everyone's eager to get to know you, Alexa. Alright, then who wants to be the first to ask our new friend a question? What's your favorite thing about Pokemon? I like everything about Pokemon. I'm totally the same. Sure you are, kid. Oh my god, you. Jesus Christ, why can't I escape you? So spill, Alexa. What do you hope to get out of it? You must have some kind of dream, right? I want to be a strong trainer. You will be. Oh, I just know it. You and me, we're gonna get, we're gonna get to so strong battling together? Okay. I'm Mr. Chuck. Okay. I should see second row front of the room. Be nice and friendly to our new classmate. We will, Mr. Chuck. Man, this lag. Wait, I thought. Wait, what? No class? She got caught in the staff room just now. Wouldn't I have heard it? Okay. How do I leave? Yes, we can move around to school. We're free. Wait, we have to choose? Oh my god. We can't explore the whole can't, we can't explore the whole room. Or the whole uh, building. Wow. Okay. Oh, the cafeteria. Okay, it's kinda um it's like buffet style? What? It's full of nutrients. Okay. Mmm, delicious. What do you have today? Oh, wait, we can order food? Okay. Pickle sandwiches. Wait a minute. Pickle sandwich. I like the remix of the music. Who is that? Who is that? 
Who is that? I need to know. Very well, Champion Amona. I trust you to handle this in my steed. She's a champion? I'm glad to hear a good day then. Um. Okay. Look at that dude's haircut. <laughs> what the? Uh, he needs to go back to the barber, not gonna lie. Oh, which reminds me, remember in Homer when I asked what, about what your dream was? Well, since your heart's already set on becoming a really strong trainer, I've got an idea for you. Champion rank like me. Yeah, I will. It'll be easy. The trainers who reach champion rank are the ones who raise their Pokemon really strong. Your, your Pokemon are not strong, they're like the same level as mine. No, weaker. Okay. Okay. I guess you could say my journey to becoming a champion was the treasure I found, maybe. I don't know yet if that's the answer I'm looking for. Anyway, I've got a feeling I'd be able to get even stronger if you and I were to be I've been working at it. Okay. Let me go ahead and save the gym's locations in your map app in case you decide to go for it. Oh, okay. So I guess we can tackle them in any order? Oh. Okay. So there's no fire type gym? I guess it has to be, um, let's see. So, no fire type. Um. No dark type. Okay. And no fairy type. So yeah. The ghost type, ice type, and um, bug type were probably replaced in different games. Or in Scarlet. Okay. Oh hey, so you meet again. You remember me, right? Um, <laughs> what? Come on, I gave you Meridun's Pokeball. Did I forget to introduce myself? Well, the name's Arvin. No need to tell me your name, Alexa, right? Yeah. Yeah, I'm pretty special, you know. I am the main character, after all. Our new celebrity. So I can finally make my dream a reality. Uh, what's this dream? Caught your interest, have I? You want to hear it all about my dream, right? Okay. I found this book the other day and it had a section about these urban mystic things. Oh, okay. It'll even boost the immune system. Okay. By Titan Pokemon, meaning that's gonna be pretty tough to try to grab a few springs. Okay, so this is basically must be just teaching us about like the main objectives. As we descend further into Area Zero, we begin to catch glimpses of mysterious Pokemon. Though we wonder if these compact, cruel beasts were indeed Pokemon at all, one of our team suffered a brutal blow from such a beast and was mortally wounded, forcing us to retreat for a time. A member of the survey team captured his pho photograph by chance. I noticed a passing resemblance to the Pokemon known as Donphan, yet differences such as its texture and the way it moves suggest it is biologically separate, to say nothing of its treads of iron. Oh. I really wanted to get those herbs for myself, but I'm not very good at Pokemon battles. I don't have any friends with strong Pokemon to lend me a hand either. Yeah, I'd never hear the end of it if I were crawling to the student council girl. But here you walk up. Okay. Yeah, sure. I'll just register a place where it seems where there might be tags on your map app for it. Okay. Also, there's five titans. 
Okay. So I guess we could sort of alternate between the two. Oh boy. It seems we finally almost reached the end of this episode. Crazy to think it's went by this fast, and yet, it still feels like so much has happened. This is the final stretch of the video, so I won't keep you guys long with this one. I just wanted to thank you guys for watching one last time, and tell you that I truly appreciate you for watching this video. It means a lot to me that you would watch this far, but could I please ask you to like the video and subscribe to the channel? This project took a long time, and it would make it feel really worth it if more people saw it. And that's our time. Alright then, guess I'll see you guys soon. This is Alexa, correct? I act your smartphone so I can talk to you, hope you don't mind. Uh... Oh, okay. The name's Cascale Pia. But never mind that. It's you I want to talk about. I hear you're a trainer with serious potential. Okay. Yes. Oh. Operation Starfall. I don't know, it seems kind of sketchy, bro. I don't really know you. But sure, you know, I'm always about helping out people. Especially people who hack my phone. Wow, you don't even care. Everyone hate. wow, everyone just does not want me to reply. Jesus, no point in answering. Oh, you again. I mean, oh, you again. If you're making calls within the school. He doesn't care about having phones out, just as long as you're respectful? Of course, sir. Wow. W teacher. Oh. There are so many things we need to be careful about in this day and age. On you go then, young lady. Alright then. That guy does not look like a student, I just realized. He looks like way too old. Team Star, you say? So this guy's listening. Oh yeah, that guy's definitely a villain. I'm just saying, bro. That dude is sus. Like, sus to the maximum. Hello? Calling Miss Alexis to the director's office, please. Oh my god. What did I do? What did I do, man? I just got here, I swear, bro. I haven't broken any rules. Oh, we get to explore this place now. Awesome. What's this? Oh, it takes us to different places. Okay. Oh, that's the director's office. Okay. So these like little terminals. Aww. Look at all the little Pokemon just sitting around. Where are my Pokemon at? How come they get to have their Pokemon out? That's not fair. That guy has a whole TV back there, bruh. I know you see that. That is like, bro, flexing. Hello, Alexa. It is nice to meet you. My name is Professor Turo. I carry out Pokemon research within the Great Cater of Paldea. Oh, Crater. My bad. This looks like Area Zero. The professor is, in fact, a graduate of our fine academy as well as a splendid researcher. Alexa, student number. Roll, bro. Don't say my whole government name, too. Pokemon Mariah, is that correct? No. Why would you attempt to lie? You appear in any number of clips from security camera footage. Then why did you ask me if you already knew, bro? Why would you ask me if you already knew? That is so dumb. Like, bro, it's just like, what? Ah, uh, not that I do not mean to offend you, in fact. In fact, I wish to ask for your assistance. With what? Hmm? What the? It's been quite a while since we last bit. Right, I was with my care, you see. Huh? 
Oh. I'm no longer in any position to be able to manage that Pokemon myself. Will you continue looking after my ride out on my behalf? Sure. Currently incapable of battle. It can, however, take on a form specialized for mobility. Okay. Oh. Well, my contact information. My phone gets out itself, you know. Okay. Already. Okay. Your very own private room. I get my own room? Oh my god. I get my own room. Best game ever. Best Pokemon game. Instantly 10 out of 10. Perfect. <gasps> it's so spacious! Oh my god, it's like a real dorm! Actually, it's new to me as this to you. Never been in here before. Actually, no, it's way too big to be a dorm room. Man. Oh, this is so exciting. It's like I'm really living here. Excellent. It seems everyone is here. Well then, it's time to explain your independent studies assignment. As usual, the theme will be a treasure hunt. <laughs> Epic. I ask each of you to set out and travel the world in search of your own treasure. You have all learned much within the walls of our fine academy. I haven't learned anything. But now it's time to turn your eyes upon the wider world and deepen your understanding. Explore Paldea's abundant nature, soak in its rich culture. Discover the Pokemon that live here. And get to know the people too. Bro, this is cool. And wherever you travel, who you meet, and what would you achieve? Of course, your Pokemon partners will be there to help you. You will journey together, learn new things together, share each other's thoughts and feelings, and find something you will always treasure. I look forward to welcoming you all back after your independent study. When you return to us as fine young trainers, oh boy. This is exciting. Let the treasure hunt begin. Onward! Hooray! The treasure hunt is a huge part of the Uva Academy school year. The point isn't to get us all looking for some actual hidden treasure necessarily. We're more just making our own adventures to see what experiences Paldaria has got to offer. You could try to be Pokemon gems, you could help out people in need, you could hunt for a real capital T treasure. Capital T treasure if you've wanted even. There's stuff we'd never learn sitting in a classroom, you know, this is our chance to learn it. Okay. Plus, there's so many chances to battle, which is obviously perfect for me. You and me for sure gotta battle if we run into each other out there. Hope you're ready. Yeah. I'll beat you every single time, too. Oh yeah, battling can wait. I mean, I meant to tell you. Did you know your phone's map app lets you set yourself that... Set, let you set yourself that... <laughs> destinations? Jesus. You can try setting one for the gyms, one of the gyms as your destination. That'd get you on your way easy. How's that for a student council president giving your, your own friends an insider advantage? Okay. Arvin? Les is going to have her hands full of searching out Titan Pokemon with me. Chasing after the champion rank. Oh, wait, do we have to choose? Wait, do we have to choose which adventure we do? In Serial? Don't go filling her head with weird stories. Hey, all I did was invite her along. It's still up to Alexa where she goes, right? Wait, so we have to choose. Hey, Alexa. Cassiopeia here. Remember what I told you before, Team Star is made out of five maybe up of five individual squads and each one's got their own base. What? Oh my god, so much stuff. 
specialize in different Pokemon types. Just remember the names of your crews and you'll figure it out. Oh, wait. Oh. Okay, so I guess the rest of them are going to be... Oh. What? Bro, we've got like 80 different objectives. Oh my god, this is going to be a huge game. Jesus. So there's three different story modes. Okay. I'll hook you up with some nice auroras every time you beat one. Who are you supposed to be? In Team Star, those punks are a serious hazard. They're not Alexa's problem. Because she's got more important things to do, like searching out awesome ingredients with me. Wasn't that what you said, Nimona and Arvin? Hmm? Oh, exposed. I'm looking forward to seeing what we, you can pull out off, Alexa. Bye. I'm glad you're making plenty of friends here, but try not to get dragged into any da anything dangerous. We've got a big adventure to start. I'm going to battle every single Pokemon trainer I meet. If I just keep trying to become the strongest, I bet that experience will be the thing I treasure. Guess I'll start by heading to a gym and training up some new Pokemon here. I'll send you a pic of what the gym buildings look like. Okay. Oh, and I know we've been running out our mouths, but it's your call what you what you do, Alexa. Go where you want and do what is what you was really important the most. Treasure our very own. That's got to be my er my big dream of tracking down the Herba Mystica. That is, once we get those herbs, I'll make you the absolute best sandwich you've had in your life. Okay. Arg, what do you what do you come out for? Oh my gosh, it just come out because you said sandwich. <laughs> oh, bruh. Well, you're not getting one. Ah, uh, he wants one. He wants to start moving. Is it telling you to get on, Alexa? Press the plus button to jump into onto Maridon. Oh, fine. You can get around more quickly. Okay. Oh yeah, we finally can ride, boys. We're finally mobile. Yes, sir. Oh, it transformed. Now it really looks like some kind of weird cyclizer. As long as you got Maridon, you can go pretty much anywhere. Proud day is your cloister. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Well, if you're going to search for those Titans Pokemon, I'd say get out, set out from the East Gate. But since Alexia is actually headed to take on some gems, I'd say go for the West Gate. It's way too, too easy to get lost out East. I'm out here. I'm out of here. Catch up soon, little buddy. Okay. See you around, Alexa. You're free to decide where you want to go as you search for the treasure all your own. Okay. Um, okay. But yeah. We finished the tutorial, I suppose. Now we're free to pretty much go wherever we want. So, I don't really know how I'm going to tackle this game. Um, if I can tackle the whole game at once, or if I'm like locked to one specific area. Like one, one specific pad per playthrough or what but yeah i'm gonna try to tackle the whole game pretty much but yeah this is i'm um, gonna be a pretty long series i imagine and i'm probably gonna be doing it for a long time so yeah hope you guys enjoyed this first episode um yeah i'll see you guys um next time